Welcome back to the Midnight Scooby Show, and we have reached the end of the Hanna-Barbera summer. I really hope you guys have enjoyed these videos as much as I have re-watching all these Hanna-Barbera shows. It was a real blast. Hanna-Barbera produced some really creative and imaginative shows, and tonight we're going to talk about a very creative one that they did. Tonight we're going to be talking about the Herculoids. Now, this is of course on the planet Asmot, later known as Quasar on the revival of the show, because you can tell it's the complete original series. But there's the three humanoids, Xandor, Tara, and Dorno, and they have these each very unique looking alien creatures. And I really love the designs on them. And they each give them their own like powers and abilities which help basically protect their home planet. We got Ock, the flying dragon, the Igu, the rock-like creature, the, the rhinoceros-type creature, Tundro, and my favorite, Gloop and Gleep. I just love their names. And here's a little look at a little bit about this show on the back. And one of the episodes I'm going to highlight in this little video is Attack from Space. It gives a really good example of what this show is about, and it's just a really fun action adventure, and I had a blast watching it. So in this episode, their planet is being bombarded by another one, led by Zagel, their henchman who has set out to destroy this planet. So they have to go there. And I just really laughed how they have to kind of board a spaceship and they kind of have to tie down all of their creatures except the dragon. It's just really creative. And what I really do like about it is how, even with the limited budget that Hanna-Barbera did, when I was watching this, it's very simple animation. You know, the planet does look very Earth-like with the rocks and all that, but with the background work and all these creature designs, they really make it feel like another world. I think Cannibal Rear did a great job with it. And I really do like the alien species in this episode. They're really kind of creative. And I really like their kind of like lairs. They just keep sending out these missiles. And it was great to watch how the Herculoids all work together to really stop them. You get to really see how these creatures of the Herculoids kind of each have their own little special powers that really help them, you know, flying. And the Igu can just rip open that and they blast stuff with the rhinoceros and Gleep and Gloop just can transform and protect them. It's so cool and I just love the creativity in this episode because, you know, they're just stopping these bad guys from destroying their planet and that's the whole episode. It's a really fun little action show. I think Kendall Barbera did a great job with it. Uh, but what did you guys think of the Herculoids? Have you watched any of it? Let me know your thoughts on the comments below. And that's it. The Hanna-Barbera summer is over, at least for 2023. I, I hope you guys enjoyed this video and all the other ones that I did. And I'm going to be on a little small little break. And I'll announce when I return in a separate video that will be released very soon. But until then, have a great rest of your guys' summer. And I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye, everyone.